All right, so this is gonna be a video where I work out an example of a slope fields problem. So it says match the following slope fields with their differential equations. So I'm gonna start with A right here with sine X. And if you notice, it says the derivative is equal to sine X. So the derivative is only based on the value of X. So that means the derivative should only be changing with X because Y is not on this side of the equation. So we are going to be looking for one of these Roman numerals here to match up with it where the y is the same throughout the entire thing. Now it's also this it's also similar here. There's no y in this equation. This one has x and y, so it's dependent on the x and y value. This one is only dependent on the y. So when doing these types of problems, I always look for the ones where it just has x. All right, so for a it says sine x. Well, it's kind of easy because you can kind of see that this one's actually going up and down the the, the y stays the same like I just said it only changes when the, the x changes also if you notice if you put 0 in for x it'd be 0 which is what we have right here if you put 0 in uh, also it's going up and down like a, like a trig function would be so this first one is gonna match up with that one so that this Roman numeral 3 should be a alright the next one I'm gonna do is that derivative is equal to x one right here an easy way to think about this one is you can actually do the uh, antiderivative pretty easily on this. It's just going to be x squared over 2 plus c. The only one that actually has a parabola, if you look at it, would be this second one right here. If you notice, it kind of forms the shape of a parabola at each one of these, x squared over 2 plus c. So this one would be, this one would match up with number two right here. All right, C, it says two minus Y. So we're looking for one that's only affected by the Y. The X doesn't change. So as you go left to right, it should not change. You notice with one, it's left to right, it's not changing. This one over here, left to right, it is changing. So the only one that could work for C would be Roman numeral one. So these match right here. And there's only one left, but it's still good to check it anyway. So for B, it's got X and Y in it. So we're doing this one right here. And if you notice, an easy one to pick is the origin, zero, zero. Well, zero plus zero is zero slope, so that works. And then maybe another good one to pick is like uh, negative one for X and one for Y, because then it would be zero again there, right there. You could see that it's zero. So that one matches as well. So I'm gonna put an arrow here. So that's Roman numeral four. So that's basically how to do an example problem where you're matching slope fields with their differential equation. If you have any questions on anything in this video, let me know.